I've responded to many other, you know, tragic accidents and, and smaller fires and so forth, but never anything of this magnitude. Have it. This is this could be a career fire. Continuing coverage of this weekend's massive condo fire out on the island. Channel 5's Rudy Mideles with how first responders were able to team up and save lives. From Port Isabel to Far, 15 fire departments stepped up to help their brothers and sisters on South Padre Island. With a smaller department, South Padre Island Fire and Ocean Rescue were in for the firefight of their lives Saturday morning. Thanks to a mutual aid agreement with several other agencies, they managed to save lives and limit the structure damage to just one building. Chief Pig explained the importance of mutual aid agreements. That's what a fire department is. That's from the beginning of time since, you know, fire departments were volunteer departments back when they first became fire brigades. So the importance of them is it's, it's not, you couldn't function without it. If we didn't have those, we wouldn't have anybody that, that automatically responded. A response this team had never seen before. 15 years with the department, I've never seen that happen. We, we have called for Brownsville before and for Harlingen before, but to have those agencies respond the way they did. Cameron County Emergency Management did an outstanding job of, of getting in touch with me when I uh, was on scene, finding out what resources I needed, what trucks I needed, what type of apparatus, and they just had the valley coming. From Red Cross to assist two displaced residents to pizza from local joints, mutual aid went further than just the valley's fire crews. We have an awesome area that we live on, an amazing island, amazing residents, and even the tourists that were here were lending a hand. We, we had firefighters that were staying in some of the surrounding hotels coming up and asking what they could do to help. The response even included video from social media and travelers in neighboring hotels. By watching that, it kind of gave us a, a, a heads up on where the, the start of the fire was. We, we, again, we're still looking into what the cause was, but you know, watching those videos shows us where the origin was, how it spread, what its rate, rate of travel was. So yeah, they, they definitely helped. The response was one for the books. Thanks to mutual aid, it wasn't worse. We just can't thank everybody enough for the support that they gave us and how hard they worked and, and got in there and gave us our guys a spell and let them, you know, rotate shifts in and out to where everybody didn't get too exhausted, which most everybody did anyway. Uh, it was one heck of a fire. Chief Pig added that the investigation into the cause is ongoing, and with teamwork like Saturday's, the joint investigation between his department, Cameron County, and state officials will help close the case. In Brownsville, Rudy Mireles, Channel 5 News at 6.